Hello and welcome to OIM Soapbox Part 2. Today we will install Oracle OID connector, OIM OID connector. And as you can see here, I, I already download from Oracle site the connector, OID connector. And I already unzipped this file into this directory. This is the directory that uh, Oracle OIM will recognize the, the, the OID connector or any other connector that you download from there. So let's install OID connector right now. Yeah, my password. Administration. Advanced. Manage connector. Install. Uh, here in this page, uh, if you put in the right place the connector in the right directory here you will see oh sorry you will see the connector there if you did not put properly you will not see this option here in this checkbox so pay attention to this part and then click on the connector that you want to install load as you can see, <coughs> uh, there is no uh, first installation before this installation that we are doing now, and there is no dependencies on other connectors to install this Oracle Internet Director connector. So let's go. Click and continue to install this. <coughs> you will see three tasks here these three tasks need to be completed to successful installation of this connector Basically, these tasks uh, are, are tasks that if you had a, a chance to work with 903, OIM 903, uh, is like this, that task is that you need to copy XMLs, run some scripts uh, into database to include these XMLs and these forms, these uh, details of the connectors inside of database. So basically, uh, this step here is doing that, but uh, behind the scenes, not you don't need to do that anymore since OIM 9101, so it's much better. So, after some time, we have completed this installation, OID, or Container Director installation, into 11G. Basically the installation is this, the next step, next video, I will show you how to configure the IT resources and all the details and the first provision for OID. Thank you very much for your attention, bye.